Hello and welcome, my friends, to another episode of Let's Play Persona 5. Uh, we still need to find out what we're going to do about Angelus. Didn't he save all of you? If we aren't going to act now, when will we? I know, I even got myself shot for all you guys. We gotta do something! Yeah, now's not the time to be hanging our heads. Hmm, what can we do without using the metaverse? Maybe we'll be able to find something if we search around. Let's just calm down and think about it. We've escaped death countless times before. There's no doubt we can do this. I know, we just fought a, and defeated a god. That's right, let's go! We're gonna save our leader, no matter what it takes! Are we gonna be able to control them now? How is this gonna work? Oh, uh, here right. we go. We will now begin the interrogation. You acted as the leader of the Phantom Thieves that undermined our society, is that correct? No, we saved society. What you thought you were doing doesn't matter now. Moving on. Hey, you asked me a question and I answered it as truthfully as I could. You know, as the leader, not what you think the truth is. As leader of the Phantom Thieves, you committed a number of crimes. Illegal entry into the Mwanda Romney residence and Okumura Foods, destruction of property. Ah, and the broadcast signal intrusion the other day was in violation of the radio law. Yeah, well... Um, if it wasn't for us doing that, uh, you would be a puff of smoke right now, sir. You and everyone else would be a puff of smoke. No, you and all of reality would have been a puff of smoke. There are some other infractions as well. On top of all that, you have a past history of crime, correct? Hmm. Your transport to Juvenile Hall has been decided. We will transfer you in the coming days. Uh, this really stinks. And what? Do the Phantom Thieves really exist? It dropped? Whoa, we're jumping. I really spent Christmas being sent to Juvenile Hall. Seriously. It's New Year's Eve now. Just look at them all party down there. They don't even know. <laughs> Guess that's fine. I wish he... he could be here with us. That said, we have our cellular phones, yes? Was there truly a need to meet? Our next move's important. We gotta get pumped! <laughs> Besides, don't you think it's nice talking in person? New Year's Eve. It seems rowdier this year, doesn't it? We'll need to brace ourselves. What did you guys plan I'm going to on doing? Contacting my father's associates. Yeah, sounds good to me. Sounds like we're set. We must succeed, no matter the cost. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do this. I love this. Whatever they're planning, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what they're going to pull off, especially without the metaverse. January 3rd? Huh? Really? Now that we know the name, all we need is an address. Oh, really? You're right. You're right. We'll succeed if we do all do it together. Sis has yet to say anything, but I believe she's looking into possible actions as well. As for me, I will look into every viable solution. Thank you. Make sure you give my regards to Shiho-san. Hey! Oh, and could we try getting their help as well? I'm sure, sure they would gladly cooperate. That would be a great help. I'll leave that to you. Yes. Mm-hmm. We'll talk again tomorrow. Let's save him, no matter what. them. Is he referring to everyone? Mm. Yeah, everyone who we maxed out. I'll announce his name as the key figure in the completion of the medicine at the next conference. I've heard that Miwa-chan's progress is going well. Indeed, that's true, but I'm certain that this will help prove his good character in the trials. Please, I want to increase his chances of being found innocent as much as possible. I see, so that's why... 
you'll cooperate too, right? And so, we need to release an official opinion from this school to object his arrest to the police. You'll all agree with me, correct? No way! What good are teachers if they don't believe in their students? Nice. I really wish I got EY maxed out for this, because it would be really cool to see someone like him being on my side. But please, I beg you, please help me collect enough signatures. I want to help my dad, who's innocent. My daddy. He's a really good guy. He always fights for the sake of others. He, he's, he's my best daddy. Next to Ryuji. Everyone. A certain young man is faced with a dilemma due to the unjust oppression by the government. He is suffering from a crime he did not commit. He is a promising young man who will support this country's future. What justice is there in a country without it being able to save such an individual? This cannot be allowed. Yes. Yes, it's thanks to that young man. The reason I was able to escape from that f the fixed matches is because of his devoted support. However, such a young man with an honest heart is currently in juvenile hall serving an undeserved sentence. This time, I wish to be the one to help him out. It'd be really cool to see what it would be like if I maxed out everyone, which I'm sure it's possible. I'm still in my sentence, in my cell. <laughs> Magnificent! If the metaverse is gone, why is the Velvet Room still here? But you're confined in reality now. Even after you escape the prison within your heart. What an ironic turn of events because you wished for the fortune of others over your own well-being. That is very ironic. Tragically ironic. Still, it will do. You chose the correct path with your own volition. You did not compromise your beliefs for personal gain to the very end. The Whoa. last arcana you have taken hold of is the world. It is I the have... willpower to stand up in this world on your own feet, unswayed by no one. The world. That will become the basis of hope toward a future with your teammates who share the same belief. Now that you've gained that power, you are no longer an existence that wanders alone. Okay. My own duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. N guest? I thought it was an inmate. See a penguin. Real penguin, I guess. Okay. And I'm gone. They gave me the world and I'm incarcerated. Okay, January 13. We're just jumping around all over the place. February 13. We're, it's almost Valentine's Day. Long time no see. Hi. I have two great pieces of news for you today. Okay. First, we finally managed to prosecute Masayo Shishido. He'll likely be found guilty. Oh, sweet. Is the second really awesome news that Ryuji is coming to visit me next? I'm grateful for your cooperation with the trial. Your testimony proved to be very useful. I'm glad to hear that. To be frank, it seemed almost hopeless at one point. But thanks to the civil protests, some of the more indecisive prosecutors came to our side. 
It will likely be some more time until the hearing begins, but this is the first step to true change. The Great. only charges right now are for breaking election laws, breaking funding control laws, and bribery. Oh, that's all. I knew that proving the metaverse's existence would be difficult, but I still find myself dissatisfied. Shido did admit to all of his crimes, though, including everything you know about. Now for the other piece of good news. As of today, you'll be free to go. Really? Really? That's right. Shido's confession brought light to the truth of your case. We were able to prove your innocence in the original assault charge that led to your arrest. So wait, what were my companions, what were my friends doing? Your sentence will no doubt be rescinded. You're a free man. Really? The others did everything they could for you. What Bringing exactly the did they do? Who was the victim in your case as a witness was the turning point. And that wasn't all. An unbelievable amount of support has come in from various other places as well. To think they'd be able to track down someone involved in a case from well over a year ago. Regardless, the righteous phantom thieves are gone. All that remains is for us adults to lead society in the right direction. Good. Well, I'm glad that you, part of that was deciding not to punish me, Angelus, for saving everybody. Then again, I have to wonder if you believe what I say. We made a promise. Thank you. Still, I'm glad I was able to save you in court. I've never felt so happy in my entire life. I know, and tomorrow's <gasps> Valentine's I'm not Day. Not quite sure how to put it, but saving your future meant more to me than my own career. Then you know what? That means your heart did change, Sai. I feel like you even taught me how to live. That's what we do. That's what the Phantom Thieves do. Uh. That wasn't my intention. <laughs> that's not true. By the way, there's something that's been on my mind. What did the treasure of my world turn out to be? Why do you want to know? That's, that's a good question. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> and that's perfectly fine. This isn't an investigation after all. I don't remember I what it was. I suppose it doesn't matter now one way or the other. There is one more thing. I haven't even told Makoto about this, but I realized something after meeting all of you. My most prized treasure is the justice I use to protect those important to me. Makoto helped show me that as well. Once the Shido case is settled, I'm thinking of quitting my job and becoming a defense lawyer. Oh, well, good on you. I wanted to reform the system, but I'll have to leave that to someone else. Well, best of luck on your your new position. Going forward, I want to enact justice not for myself, but for the sake of others. That's noble. <laughs> well then, I need to go submit the paperwork for your release. Perfect. Oh, that reminds me. May I ask you one final thing? Sure. Sure. There's more. According to your testimony, you could have stopped after taking Kamoshida down, couldn't you? Why did you continue acting as the Phantom Thieves? Perhaps I'm thinking too much into this, but a thief who justly stole the hearts of others, and a criminal who controlled them for his own gain. It seems your destiny has been tied to Shido's for some time, and now it's finally settled. Doesn't this seem a little too perfect? It's almost as though someone planned it all. Like the video game developers. She has a point. Had I not encountered Shido back at the ho that hotel, the Phantom Thieves may not have continued on. Could it be that this was your goal from the very beginning? It was all a game. A game. Yep, that is, and with that, that is very meta, as in, as in metaverse, right? Get it? Get it? That's yeah. quite a fitting response for you. Oh, game. You know, this job has shown me my fair share of criminals and convicts. But if young people like you exist in this world, maybe things aren't as hopeless as they seem. Maybe. I'm sorry for rambling. I shouldn't keep that man waiting for too long. Thank you again for everything you've done. And thank you for setting me free. See you later. 
See ya, Sai. I like Sai. <gasps> yes, I'm a free man, Ryuji. I'm coming home, buddy. At long last. Hey, you kept me waiting. Jeez. To be honest, I didn't really want to come. Really? Futaba just wouldn't stop bugging me. Anyway, you're a free man now, aren't you? Oh, world trap. <laughs> It'd look bad on me if you did something again under my watch. Mm-hmm. All right, let's go home. It's cold, so get in quick. Uh, now I want turkey and cake. I demand. After being in prison for <laughs> a, ter a, a stupid reason, cake it's and turkey. not moving at all. Due to the railway incident this morning, widespread delays have impacted the various lines and... Another accident, huh? <laughs> Reminds me of that day back in April. Remember when we went to introduce you at the school? Uh, that was such a long time ago. Oh, yeah. It's almost been a whole year since then. Huh. Yeah. Thinking back, that was pretty awful to you. Yeah. Throwing you in that storage room all by yourself. Yeah, you were pretty awful to me. Like, almost Dursley level of awful. And again, soon you're gonna be... Made some great friends here. You better thank them when we get back, alright? Yusuke is acting all cool. <gasps> Yay! Hey there! Huh. Yeah, let's party. Are we not gonna... Do... Okay, cool. Namaste! Whoa! Uh... You did it! It has been a while. <sighs> yeah. Thank Not you. Bad. You look fine. I'm glad you seem well. Uh, as well as I can be. Come sit over here. I gotta head out and grab some groceries. I'm sure you guys have plenty to talk about. Man, it went well, yeah? I'm so glad we didn't give up. This was certainly worth the effort. We didn't know what to do once you were gone, but... Then we realized something. Hmm? Even if we don't have the metaverse or any other special powers, we can still change reality. That, I think that was the lesson we learned from this whole adventure. Yeah, that's true. We were running around everywhere we could since the new year. It must have been over a month. Not just us. Everyone who believed in you joined us. Yeah. Thanks to that, we've got our leader back. Why, thank you all. It took you long enough. You saved me. Right back at ya. Oh, Ryuji! They treated you fine, right? Actually, did you lose some weight? It did I? Understandable. I've heard the food in prison is quite foul. Yeah, that's what I've heard. So, what did you eat? Not Was cake. It bugs? Fermented mackerel? Or maybe durian? Hey, durian's not so bad. You're missing the point. Eh, you're gonna get some good food soon enough, though. Turkey and cake. Boss please. is out getting stuff for our party right now. Actually, pie. I prefer pie over cake, personally. Don't hate me. Come on, everyone's back together. It's time to celebrate. Everyone. Well, not quite everyone. Oh, because Morgana's not here, and apparently neither is a catchy. Nobody's found right. a catchy. Morgana. He may have been the key person on this whole mission. We even considered what he would do when we were about to give up. Mona totally would have done something, right? That cat would never quit on you. He was always there to pull us forward. Morgana truly was the engine of the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> he was a car after all. True. I want to see Mona again. Huh? That was quick, boss. Oh. Someone call for me? 
Wow. Okay, you've got some explaining to do, Morgana. Mona? What are you doing here? I, I mean, didn't you disappear? Looks like the only me that disappeared was the one in the metaverse. Huh? So, you stayed in reality as a cat? So where have you been this whole time? When I woke up, I was out in Shibuya looking like this. That don't make any sense, though. I mean, if you were alive, you should have come back right away. That is true. I... What did you do this whole time? It was right after I had said goodbye. It would have been awkward to come back so soon. I don't think that's a really realistic explanation. I think the writers just wanted Morgana to wait until this dramatic moment for the best dramatic effect. Let's just be honest. Seems she finally learned how to be tactful. Yeah, yeah, that is totally what happened. Don't even try to hide it, game. <gasps> He's grown. I knew Have you, you guys gained had weight? your witness, so I was just waiting for him to get discharged. I have a name, Morgana. Well done on that, seriously. You pulled it off even without my help. You've already returned to your normal, conceited self? I'm sorry I worried you all. Oh, can I borrow the shower before you all rush to hug me? I was stray for so long, I think I might smell. That's probably not a bad idea. This ain't the time for a shower, you stupid cat! Give us our tears back! You are unforgivable. Oh gosh. Shit, stop it! <sighs> Talk about a harsh welcome. <laughs> this is how it should be. Matters are finally back to normal. Huh. Right. It's great that you're back and all, but what are you gonna do now? Huh? Well, I've been thinking. About what? How to become human, of course. Oh. Oh. Really? I might have learned that I'm not a human now, but that doesn't mean I can't turn into one. Well, that'll be an interesting adventure. Plus, I think there's a reason I survived like this. To be human? Regardless, I'm glad to see you're safe. Now, this is just a guess. But I think I'm still here because you all remained cognitive of me. If you want to become human, if you are a cat who wants to become human, you can probably do what they did in Sailor Moon R, in the Sailor Moon R movie? Even Maybe? after the world's distortions disappeared, you kept me in your minds. <laughs> that means you guys think there's a place for me in the real world. Of course! This is where you belong, Mona! <laughs> She's correct! Oh, yeah. Uh, sorry for butting in and all. But we heard from Boss. You're going back home next month? I... Can't you stay here? Uh... Yeah, can I stay here? You can come with me, Ryuji. Sure, we proved you're not guilty. But people are still gonna label you there, aren't they? Ain't it just gonna be uncomfortable going back? What's the matter? We were all so excited a moment ago. How about this? If our leader is leaving, the Phantom Thieves are truly disbanding, correct? Correct. Today, we can celebrate his release and commemorate the day of our disbandment. How about you we commemorate the time when you guys actually remember my name? <laughs> what kind of commemoration is that? I was serious when I said it. It sounds like a good idea to me. I guess you're right. We just gotta double our excitement for today. Ahem. I know this is sudden, but I've decided to go with him. Uh, if you're really that excited, you would actually remember my name. He's pretty special after all. If I was that special, you would remember my name. If I stay by him, I might be able to figure out how I can become human too. Plus, we need someone there in case he turns back into a delinquent. I was never a delinquent to begin with. I've never been a delinquent. Why do people keep saying really? that? Really? Yes. Either way, I want you guys to add my farewell party to the one we're having tonight. I don't know. Is that important? You're not leaving for another month, right? It is far too early for a farewell party. 
True. That'll just muddy the purpose of this celebration. Then it could be my comeback party. Nobody can complain about that, right? I guess. I sushi! Sushi! Man, you guys are loud. I could hear you from outside. Oh, I was wondering why I heard meowing. The cat's back. Chief, they're so mean. <sighs> Noisy as always. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm not some normal cat. <laughs> I can't understand what you're saying to me, you know. Here. No, I would much rather have sushi than something like... Hmm? This is delicious. What is it? <laughs> what an assertive little guy. I wonder where he got that from. If Morgana becomes human, he may end up just like him. <laughs> yeah, and then you would all miraculously forget his name too. Oh, I can see that. Totally possible. Me be like him? Well, that wouldn't be so bad. I definitely don't want to be like Ryuji though. Uh, Ryuji's all mine. What was that? It's things like that. You get angry so fast. Oh, and your bulker. That is true. He's got you there. You little... Why don't you go disappear again? <sighs> Shut up! We're supposed to be celebrating, not fighting. This is them celebrating. They're at it again. Yeah, this is normalcy. The world's changed, but you guys are the same as ever. Seriously, that weirdo Inari. Who are you calling a weirdo? In any case, we're all here. Let's kick this party off. The catchy's not. <sighs> Very well. Sojiro, I want sushi! All right, hooray. We all celebrate. I do like to meet. I like to meet. Yes! Valentine's Day! Yes! All right. Today's Valentine's Day. No wonder there were so many guys bringing girls in here. No guys bringing guys or girls bringing girls? Don't you have anything exciting happening? I mean, you've been here nearly a whole year. I don't know. Can we hang out with Ryuji today? No. When I was young, ooh boy. <laughs> <gasps> Ryuji! Yo. Hey, buddy! You alone, too? Step into my parlor. Yeah, don't remind me. It's all right, buddy. You got me. Come on in. It'll be my treat today. Hooray! Hey, take over for me. We got our Valentine's date with Ryuji. Just let Enjoy. me have this. Just let me have this game. Just I don't want to be a part of this loser's meeting. Hey, 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 hey. Morgana, just shoo. Good, because we don't want you here have at, anywhere this, else to at go. our date. It's okay, bud. Here, let's sit. Yeah, let's sit. Oh. First Christmas, now Valentine's Day. Why ain't I getting any chocolates? I probably would have gotten him chocolates. I've... I called Yusuke before heading over here, and even he got some. Yeah, that's that's fine. Le we we don't need to talk about Yusuke. Let's talk about us. I mean, the dude's a freak. Ryuji, don't be. That's not nice. He does have looks good. What a bizarre girl. Uh, are you jealous? I just don't get it. Besides, why isn't Mishima here too? Um, because he's our son, and that would be a little awkward if our son was here during our Valentine's Day date, I guess. And eh, sure, he can hang out. Oh, don't tell me he... Did he betray us? Mishima's an adorable young man. You know, you should be proud of our son. He won't get away with this. There is no way. Should we call him? Nah, it'd be awkward as hell if we did. What are you thinking, dude? I love you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Uh, my heart is empty. It's Valentine's Day. Do you like chocolate? It's not the point. Oh, but oh, something at the convenience store, and the shopkeeper lady gave me this. Here, <laughs> you can have it. Oh, thanks, buddy. I mean, it's not a teddy bear and a bouquet of flowers and a box of chocolates, but it's from you. 
secondhand from somebody else. Thanks. I don't need it. Is this a confession? Oh, dude, hell no! Oh, disappoint. Disappoint. Hey, now that I think about it, are our girls kind of cold? I mean, we were on the same team. They should at least got us some kind of teammate chocolate or something. <sighs> Seriously. Hmm. You're totally right. Um, I'd prefer lover's chocolate. Let's just drop it. I prefer lover's chocolate. Well, yeah, but don't exactly got that now, do we? Uh, speak for yourself. Guess heroes ain't always popular with the chicks, huh? Yeah, I don't need to be popular with the chicks, Ryuji. <sighs> I wonder if I'll get a girlfriend before I graduate high school. Uh, well, maybe you should throw out a wider net. <laughs> Ryuji's chocolate. Aww. That's so sweet. They are really, really, really trying to keep things... It's bromancy, and then it's like super, super, super heteronormative. It's so interesting. So interesting how that plays out. Anyway. Hey. hey. You're finally taking off tomorrow. I finally am. So Jiro said you don't have to help out here today. Go and see your friends before you leave. Okay. Do I have to? Off you go then. Alright. I think we're going to end the video here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, love yourselves and love each other.